Taurus, we're talking about how consistent effort um, inevitably leads to victory. We're speaking about how Jupiter's in the second house of Taurus. So that's going to bring an expansion as to how you generate income, wealth, material goods, things that you value, tangible things that you value. Okay, we were talking on and on about it. The video did not record. I was like seven minutes into your reading, but I leave it up to God, right? No energy is gained or lost. I leave it up to the G-O-D. I leave it up to the universe. Um, we're talking a lot about like your all spark, your value, your intrinsic value and worth that you bring to the table, letting that lead you. Okay, your gift, finding that gift, that talent, and letting that lead you forth to like literally like pull you up out of bed in the morning and, and take that next step here. So anything else for Taurus in conclusion, Spirit? <clears throat> I'm hearing like I'm exactly where I need to be. That's what I'm hearing, right where I need to be. Spirit of Grand Central. I'm like, guys, feel free to reach out for one-on-one -on -one reading. Um, and check out at Running Gun Tarot across all social media, depending on where you're watching this. And on TikTok, it's at Running Gun Tarot 28. So incomplete lessons with the world card in the reverse and inner knowing. Something is not yet done here. And you're still watering something. Still the energy of a student. Someone could have some, like, objectionable energy towards you. Wanting to start some mess with you. Um, something that you've ended or that you moved on, they might have a bone to pick with you. Could be that you're out of communication with them at the moment. Um, somebody was not attuned on their spiritual path. You, I'm getting that you're coming across as very high vibrational, nine of pentacle in the upright energy, single, looking good, feeling good, financially free, independent, abundant, okay? Um... Emphasis on the single. Inner discipline, restraint, facing your fears, courage, bravery. A lot of past energy wanting to come through. Spirit, I'm not interested in the protagonist's uh, energy. I'm interested in the new, the protagonist, second house, and or Taurus. Spirit, new predictions. Okay, inner contemplation. Okay, a high position here, high ranked position official might be seeing you if you are the Eight of Swords here, or you might be seeing where you could lend a hand to someone and they will want to open up towards you. The Empress is here, so this is a high vibrational energy. It feels as though that she's making a call to the Spirit Guides, okay, to bring these two people together. Fool and the Queen of Wands in the upright. Pisces, Aries energy, Aquarius energy as well. Someone might want to jump into your arms. Take me, take me into your arms. I need you more and more, whatever, whatever. Temperance in the upright. Divine timing. Woo-wee, twin flame. Damn. I don't know what is going on with that, but I predict that you will be in union. Just take it slow because the Knight of Wands is a hitter energy, like a shooter, like, you know, quick draw, McGraw, but not so great on the consistency or the stability. They do get a bad rap, the Knight of Wands in the upright. Scorpio Sag, player card of the tarot. Okay, so make sure that you are aligned with, you know, your value system before you jump into a passionate twin flame, because that will destroy the ego if you guys really don't get a hang on it, <laughs> you know, a, a handle on it. Um, anything else for Taurus? Can you offer, can you offer resource, supply, could help you growing what you're growing in the direction. Okay, second and third chance at happiness also is what I'm getting. It could be that you are kind of like slowly reintegrating yourself into the mainstream again after a period of being away for a while. That could be like taking part in, you know, watching sporting activities and just realizing how good and, and blessed that you have it. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Let's move on to Gemini and see what Spirit has to say for Gemini and or third house cross watcher. Look out for that video.